bound, bound, bound. Injected with. Dip it. This is the third time I've been injected twice in hospital and now once today. Just come back. I'm gonna keep positive. And they told me to take things down from YouTube and on my tube and the not show tube. But I'm venting and you asked what my acting skills are like, well they're all a bunch, it's an all rounder mate. And this is called venting the whole time. The time is Hey, you got it wrong in a different way. I'm just talking normal and slow. Thought of doing it in a different creative way. But thank you, I'm normal. I asked for natural healing, and that's all I want to be asking for is the natural healing. Or just take me to a natural rehab centre. Because it's the drug war you're after, after, after. It's the war on drugs. Because what I was on some drugs you don't like. So then you send the cops around and tell them I'm psychotic or psychosis. Or so they're in short term memory stuff. Uh, oh my god. Manic. I even feel my own symptoms. I feel my own self, my own being. You have no thoughts. You're just. You gotta fight any means necessary to stay up. Don't give in to these bastards that don't believe in you. I never have and never will. And I always have and always will. So it looks like I gotta pull my head in. And this could be my last video for a while uh, until or the second last uh, I'll make my last after this one. Saying till I'm off the injections, I can't fully rap anyway. My voice acting, I can't get into character because I've got no zest, no energy. And like I said, I've got no thoughts and short term memory is gone, so I won't bother venting anymore on YouTube. I go back to acting when it's all over. The rapping can wait, the projects can wait. I can't freestyle the moves, I can't come up with an end. And if I do, it's just not what, like I would like to hear, but like I was back in the day. But hey, do you want me to go lay in some hay? And say, nay? <laughs> anyway, I'll keep this as a souvenir. I'm just saying, hey, you can just dope someone up. And I don't want to be doped up, I don't want to be feeling doped up and have no memory and have no thought pattern but hey I'm always wrong and you're always right because why I'm on drugs and I can't vent because what well, cops have come and busted down my doors they've got me in my backyard and they've opened my doors because you guys have said psychosis, psychotic, manic, I'm not sure what they believed. Psychotic, never would be. Never got a weapon, never got into a punch on. Psychosis, is you don't know what the feeling of drug does to some person. It's called, woo, party time. And manic, or oh, you can talk fast on a drug, so it's all drug related. Why not get a drug rehab? No, they wanted to play with my mind and experiment on me like a lab rat, three times. I've been in there three times now. Three times too much. I shouldn't have been in there at all. But hopefully, you fight it on and just say the next fortnight, natural healing again. Natural healing. Go see this guy next week, get another opinion. If he says the same as these guys, or he's from the same building, so then don't expect otherwise that he would say anything different. He's just going off files, he's not going off my emotions. Not psychotic, not psychosis. What a joke.
I know how I feel and how I act. Always will, and you will never know. But you can tell me how I do. And if you, I don't, you threaten me with hospital, and threaten me with this, and inject me with that. Anyway, I'm not happy, but I can't be stupid. Or they take it the other way. Or I can't be angry and vent. Or they take it the other way. I can't put songs in the background and try to come up with fluency, weirdo Yankovic styles, and come up with freestyle humour back at them, back at you guys, psychiatrists and case managers, to get a point that I'm an artistic sort of person that you're stopping. But you don't care. You don't listen. You just write a report that's the opposite of what I say. And the first time I asked for a second opinion, you laughed on the phone and said, oh, you've had plenty of opinions. Why, by getting taken away by... I was on drugs, and when I was in there, I was a smart ass and I was on drugs. Always will be on drugs. What sort of drugs? You never know, because my diary says it. could be a book one day. But that's delusional right now, isn't it? You can't publish, you can't go find a book person that publishes in mental health, but it is a task. But I am a person that I was Mr. Confidence, would do anything. No task was no greater than nothing you could achieve, anything you wanted. At that moment, I can't achieve remembering my last name, my date of birth. <laughs> and I'm going to have a Christmas doll doped up. Merry Christmas, all. Happy New Year, I won't be partying this New Year. Stereo Sonics out the window. The Ice Cube concerts out the window. All the concerts are out the window because there's no point. Their drugs don't work. I mean, my ones. Because they take away the dopamine when dopamine makes you happy. These guys destroy the dopamine. When dopamine makes you happy, makes you a larrikin, makes you a comedian. Makes you yourself just ten times happier. And you're a rave and a concert and music and ice cube and rap and you feel the beat, beat and the vibe, the energy and the electricity. You have a good time. Instead, on this, you can't have any time. There's no point. And weed, it's double the strength, like I've said.